Now they race at speeds that can top 200 miles an hour. But one driver is hoping that you can still spot a special tribute on his car to a boy who gave the gift of life. Yeah, his life is going to be celebrated in front of thousands of NASCAR fans. ABC 15's Cameron Pullum is sharing with us this extremely emotional and touching story. We make the cars as light as we can to get the weight as well as the ground as we can. For the family of Calvin Mossman, this VIP treatment is both exhilarating and heartbreaking. Whenever we do stuff like this, it's bittersweet. Yeah, there's an empty spot. That spot belonged to their nine-year-old son, Calvin, who would now be 13, taken too soon after a severe asthma attack almost four years ago. His parents, John and Lisa, would eventually make the decision to donate his organs, one they say was easy. For Christmas, the list he made out was for the toys he could donate, not for himself. The giving young man would give one more time. We take what we can get knowing he lives on. His heart still beats. His eyes are still seeing. And on Thursday, the family got a surprise visit from a person who knows firsthand the difficulty of losing a loved one. I just did the best I could and try to do what uh, my mom would uh, want us to do. Xfinity driver Joey Gase lost his mother when he was 18 to a brain aneurysm. But like Calvin, he knew his mother would want to give the gift of life. Now with each new city he visits, he honors donors like Calvin. Their image front and center for all to see on Gase's race car. It lets them know and their families know that once you're an organ donor, you're, you're never forgotten. Being able to see somebody who is living because of Calvin and listen to their heartbeat and it's just, it's surreal. With a rub for good luck across his son's face, it's a lasting image of a miracle at work and a life well spent. That was Cameron Pullum reporting.